Okay, exploring the ship. That's an interesting one. So are we gonna have to fight uh, uh, some kind of uh, uh, fight invaders on our ship or something? Maybe fighting off rats? The ship looks like it's in good condition. The ship's moving and without our help. Is there a crew? Oh, we have to fight the crew, don't we? Hey, who are all you people? I don't think we're, we were expecting guests or cargo. Aye, too many for that. Where'd you all come from? How's this ship able to fit everyone? We boarded back at the Underworld. You the crew? If you don't know what, that you're aboard the silent Calico? I the... Hey, you okay? Come on, snap to it! Sorry, it's just we're on the silent Calico. Aye, the ship of the pirate Queen Mary, who commands where it goes through her will. But the three of us don't work to... Uh, the three of us don't work to do much. Except to get rid of stowaways like you. No, in our group, boss. Crap. I think I should kill off the cannoneer first. He sounds pretty dangerous. Foolish mortals, you should never ha have come on board. We, the ghost crew of... You need to stop that. I'm tired of you trying to act like this is a ghost ship. You're all wasting the hell. Uh, you're wasting all the Halloween makeup, but you know that's the captain's favorite holiday. Sorry, all you. Uh, uh, let's get serious now. Uh, do we have any good AOE attackers at all? Should I just have Arcturus spam his? his skills or something. Thing about uh, the worst part about group bosses is that it's my single target debuffs are gonna be harder to pull off. And group debuffs are probably weaker. Okay, Caltrops to begin with. Harsh words. No way, he's already attacking! Wow. Not good. Alright, dark fog on all of them. Let's hope that they actually have low accuracy. Probably not. Damn, these guys take their turns really quick. I just healed and they moved again. That sucks. Fuck. Skill defense reduce. Skip town. <laughs> the turns are way too quick. Holy shit. They better go. D Hopefully, they don't have too much hit points. Highly doubtful. Group bosses are really the worst. They they don't have the disadvantage of groups like you do. Oh man. Weak skill damage increase. Skill defense buff. Uh Okay, start getting some buffs on Arcturus. Oh shit. They have to spend a turn reloading, but that's about their only flaw. They're still way too fast. Seriously. Okay, where's Arcturus? Stoic Fury. Okay, 
Okay, so Exodus probably won't deal too much, huh? Oh, that actually w did pretty well. Ah, uh, shit, but he's just... Ow. Someone's gonna die, and hopefully it won't be Arcturus. Hopefully he can solo this shit due to all his buffs. Yeah, I'm gonna need to remove their buffs every now and then, too. Who had uh, a debuff re uh, buff removal? Take this, skip town. Ugh. Oh shit, someone's dying. This is freaking ridiculous. You guys, oh man. Romans, we're not really getting stronger after each battle either, so we're kind of, we're getting more and more screwed every fight we're in. Arcturus, you're just gonna have to solo this shit for us. You're the only one. You are the chosen one here. Just gonna have to let some people die and hope they don't target Arcturus. Yep. A lot of people dying. Prima's dead. But Arcturus is just fine. He can solo this shit. He will be the one-man army to take them all on. Ah, shit. Do I have anyone who can... I need better look for a buff remover. Overrule. Okay, back to the one-man army, Arcturus. Ugh. Exitus! Force them to exit the stage! No matter what! Yes! Okay, now that that's done, I should start using Zornfall to take out individuals. By yourself, you're nothing. Hiya! Gotcha. That's how you group attack. You're a tough bunch, eh? Practically a one-man army, since the regen uh, hit point, uh, the health steal buff will just make them recover all damage easily. As long as they have a few allies t soaking up damage, it's all good. You're a tough bunch, eh? I think we bought enough time. So wait, this is, we're instead of fighting the sea monsters, we're just fighting the entire crew of the ship we're on. Glad to know the ship's not gonna stop in the middle of the ocean just because it got invaded by a bunch of- by 199 strangers, right? Let's hope we're dealing with smaller- uh, with just a single boss this time. A queen of the high seas, let's go. We're not interested in fighting, okay? We're just trying to get to the... Look, it's not us you gotta convince. Pirate Queen Mary. I thought someone was up, and I come down and find this. I'm impressed that so many of you snuck on board. Honestly, hell of a feat. We didn't sneak on. We boarded what we thought was a ship we could use. Then I guess I ought to be ashamed of these three. Why are you all here? Why are you waiting to take my title? We're just trying to get to the Dark Lord to defeat... Is your title so easily taken? Wait, let's not escalate! Ha, huh, you think you can beat me? I fought off whole crews before, and I'll do it again. Isabel, let's not. Provina. Yes, my lady? If I'm going to accomplish my goals, I need my subordinates to have resources and reputation of their own. I order you to fight, and I order you to win. Alright, I've won plenty of uh, fights I had no right winning, and maybe this will be one of them. Provina, where are you? What damage are you good at again? We're all getting roped into this, huh? Can't say I'm surprised, but I recommend being a bit more assertive with them the next time you can get a word in. Trying not to fight is a fine thing, but you gotta get them to actually listen. Queen, Pirate Queen Mary emerged. Nothing against y'all, I just need to shake the rest off my anchor. 
What would be a good element to use against you? Should I just use Arcturus and his crazy buffs again? He's always been a pretty reliable damage dealer to me. First we'll do the usual. Debuff single target style. Hmm, what else do I need? Okay, let's try to ha let's try to do this. Covenant damage. That way, if she attacks, she'll take some a little bit of damage as well, which would be good if she pro if she tries what will likely be a mass group attack. Lower accuracy. Oh no! Why didn't she take any reflected damage? Don't tell me she's immune or something. Crap. <sighs> Who should I make my main attacker? Probably Arcturus again. I can't see her. I don't see any reason why she should resist slashing damage. As usual, Arcturus will be the main attacker. Yeah. If I'm wrong, then I guess I better sh restart the battle and choose someone else. Skill damage buff. Skill defense would never hurt anyone either. Okay, Dominic, let's use Life is Pain on Arcturus. Ah, my attack evasion is reduced. Okay, Arcturus... No wait, Tidir, 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 you need to... ...use whereabouts. Yes. So that Arcturus can deal maximum damage. Stoic Fury. Now I'm starting to see why Arcturus was considered a, a hero who defeated the previous Dark Lord. Oh, nice! So I can use it. I can do this all day. Assuming you'll have any other tricks up your sleeve. Oh no. Skills are being. Re okay, she's not. Actually, she's actually a bit. Seems a bit easier than her minions. At least uh, when they're all together, working together. Yeah. A little more. Oh no, they got Josephine too. She's supposed to be my main single target healer. Oh well. Fire Queen's dead anyways. Phew, you're a real deal, all right. Now let's really get serious. Kevin, I'm pretty sure we just ran into a reef. That's gonna take a lot of work. So what, let's finish what we started. There's plenty of us here to help if you need it. Help? We're just trying to get across the sea. You can control the ship, but can you repair it quickly? Some of you know water magic, woodworking, that sort of thing. Yes, we've got plenty of people for that. I'm guessing the next stage will just simply be fixing the ship by talking to NPCs. 
Respite on the silent Calico. Many of my friends are helping out with the ship, so maybe now's a good time to check up on the others. This is a recess level. You can interact with characters to see what they're doing. There's no hidden, nothing hidden to find, and there's no objective. It's just the time for everyone to breathe, relax, and interact. Feel free to leave through the stairs to head to the next level whenever. Sure, there's no secret. <laughs> maybe secret item. I'm keeping watch while the princess sleeps. Yeah, she actually gave me a ring, so I never actually need sleep. I never slept good anyway, so don't mind it. Come in, uh, come in if you need to, but please keep quiet. Surprising that Adelaide can sleep with all that makeup. Princess Isabel seems to be snoring slightly. Dad really, really likes his naps. Yeah, he is the one doing most of the work due to my strategy of you taking advantage of his MP cost reduction buff. Hey there, kid. They've actually got a good stock of drinks if you want something. If you want soda, you can talk to Ayako. I don't know where she gets it from, but her world has some neat drinks. Hmm? The ears? Magic accident. Okay, so when they draw near, we... Oh, hey, one of the gunners by the ship weighs out. They think it's pri privateers. You think the Dark Lord has a navy? Probably. I mean, she's gotta have a lot of people working for her, right? Probably has a crew and ship to spare. Hmm. So the ship's probably not a friendly one. We can't risk losing you, so what? leave it to the rest of us if things get shaky. I'm guessing the next boss is gonna be an entire freaking ship, right? Oh, you can sit with us if you want. Provina's going over some stuff. We're talking about doing some upgrades to this ship. It's a good piece of work, but there's always room to improve. I'm nearly finished drawing up blueprints for the current ship design. From there, we'll look at what we can adjust with the materials we have on hand, and what will take uh, what will take the least effort. We probably won't do anything with it, but if I'm not working on something, I feel more stressed than when I work. I'm taking a quick break from cleaning. My mistress is annoyed with how dusty it is on this part of the ship, so she's re refusing to come down until I deal with it. I don't mind, honestly. I'm just glad she hasn't gotten seasick in front of everybody. I uh, don't go spraying that part around. Becca wants to do some sh work in the ship, so I'm gonna have to do the physical crafting and she'll do the follow-up. Oh, Mason's still just work of stone. We use all sorts of materials. I did some ship work back when I was an apprentice. Josephine, I'm just killing time like everyone else. Enjoying the boat ride? Yeah, I think it's a bit choppy, but it's not so bad. Never been on a, on a big on sea travel, though. Aw, oh, this is good tea. Want to join us, kiddo? We're having tea and coffee during the downtime. What the... What's Livius doing on the way back here? Livius seems to be trying to get at a mouse between the crates. Okay, so that's everyone in this room. Yo, need something? Let me check my bag. Oh, there it is. I have plenty. Ice cold cola. So, both of these are exits. Seems that some of the ellipses will change the dialogue a bit. Weird. Well, it's not much else I can really do here, I guess. Okay, now we can head to number four. Wait, there's only five battle- uh, five areas in this map? Ship battle, ready? Look alive, everyone! We've got an enemy ship up ahead. The Dark Lord ship, most likely. Um, what? Privateer emerged, and they don't even get all my party members. Alright, let's get to it. Defeat the privateer ship and do not let our ship sink. What the heck? Mary's a character here, too. However, the ship itself cannot attack. Oh, shoot. Turn 
turn about. But I can only use it once. Dang it. How do I regenerate MP here? This is weird. I don't have focus, and I don't have normal attack. I can use help out, but how, who's gonna help the workers? This is really messy. I don't know how I'm supposed to pull this one off. Focus on steering the ship. I ain't gonna do ramming, that's dangerous. I only have a limited set of actions. I have to kill them with one fell swoop. Siege Ender should be my finishing move, huh? Oh shit, they can do the same- I'm sure the enemies have the same moveset as me. Whirlpool. Wait. Wait a minute, can I- Will this even do anything? I see, if I, c I could use a healing potion in this battle, but I don't know if it'll be any good, considering the huge hit point differences. We don't really have any buffing abilities, do we? Distraction? What does that do? Delay the enemy or something? What does Sabotage do? I don't understand. Yeah, I'm gonna save Z for last. Significant damage to enemy ship. Ramming speed seems kind of dangerous. But let's give it a shot. Oh, their cannons can backfire. They're protected. Oh, shoot. Wait, did we regenerate MP? Oh, that makes our life a little easier. That means they will soak up one attack, so I should make it a weak attack. Oh no, it's only cannon fire, right? Distraction. Okay, if we regenerate MP, I'm just gonna have to remove their barrier a bit. Oh, they've been set on fire somehow, what the heck? Ramming. We're winning so far, I think. But oh, I have to force them to soak up some damage, too. No longer on fire. Okay, we're regenerating some MP. That's good. Good. Turn about. Sabotage. Flame cannon. Whirlpool.
Ah! Okay, let's repair the ship. Four forty, that's it. Nice, nice. Oh shit, am I on fire? No, I'm not. I guess they missed somehow. I, I got lucky. Fire cannon. Siege Ender, is that strong enough yet? Oh, it's pretty strong, and we also don't have to worry about the damage limit as much. We can still deal- we can deal quadruple damage just fine. Ah. Sabotage. Fire cannon. Ram. We've got them on the ropes. Oh no, I'm on fire. Calming waters. Siege Ender. There we go. That wasn't as bad as I thought, mainly due to the MP regen. Good work. This helps appreciate it. One of you said it's your stop up ahead, so I gotta assess this damage anyway. Oh, what the heck? Everyone just suddenly popped out. And some of them are drowning. I don't know if this is a good thing. Simple Island Cuisine, huh? But we're gonna be traveling here, it's best to eat some fresh stuff now and save rations and such for less plentiful places. I told some of the artists to get some ingredients. Mind grabbing them and being my so-chef so for a bit? Come back to me when you, whenever you've grabbed everything. Huh, no boss for this level? Unless we have to hunt some monsters? Oh, Josephine, I found the spices for the meal and ground them up. Now, I know what's the smart thing to do, but hear me out. Well, we gave her gunpowder instead. There's no way she's not gonna know the difference. Plus, I'd like the food to be, you know, food. Here, just take both. I have too much of this stuff anyway. Why do you have so much of this stuff? I stockpiled a bunch for our job. Don't ask. You're honestly better off for never, uh, for never knowing. Ground spices and gunpowder. Huh. Oh, you're quite sneaky. Need something? So you're collecting the stuff. Well, we found some fruit, but... I can't really tell which of... Uh, which of these is which. She just told me orange fruit with thick skin. Dia's normally pretty helpful with this sort of thing, but they seem to be distracted. I saw Rosemary with some interesting shoes, and sh she said were ideal for the environment. They make a nice clapping sound as I walk. Anyway, well, that one is apparently lear learning what sandals are. Take these. We're gonna go for a walk. Orange and pumpkin. Both are edible, so that's a little bit of a tougher choice. I'm gonna go with orange, though. Oh, getting the stuff for the chef? I got the bamboo she wanted. Wait, that's not right. She asked for sugar cane. I... hmm. 
I'm not saying you're wrong, but I really don't think that's what she was asking for. Wait, I don't even see any of that around here. Where do you find it? Oh, you just didn't... Alright, alright, Brian, I snuck a crate of it from the ship. I do want sweet foods. It still needs to be processed before. And maybe she knows how to cook it into something anyway. If not, there's still this. Bamboo and sugar cane. Okay, so that's all the ingredients. The Litzel's old, old ca uh, cauldrons. Ah, oh, great. Let's see what we got. Alright, first I'm gonna need some oranges. What if I give her wrong ingredients? Sugar cane. Hmm. I didn't think there was even sugar cane in this area. I can cut it open and use the juice at least. Gunpowder. Th this isn't spice. I mean, I guess it could add some strong zest. Okay, let's see how this turns out. I'm going to need to keep cooking so everyone can have some, but here's a big helping for helping me out. Orange souffle. The gunpowder really contrasts with the sweetness. Wait, that was it? Is there a, an alternate way to get this? Is it always going to be orange souffle? Hold on. I don't even see it in the item list. It's possible it's just a gag and you win no matter which ingredients you pick. Okay, so if we're picking all the wrong options to get pumpkin cookies, I'm sure there's a lot of different combinations you could do. They aren't bad, but have quite the unusual aftertaste. Orange fried rice is what you get for using the, the, the normal ingredients. Oh, there's... Wow, there's a lot more than I thought. Eight... Eight ba uh, stages here. Field trip number three. I told the kids to break up into groups and practice with some of our spe other spellcasters. Getting used to the difference in mana flow in different places is important, but they've been out a while. Mind bringing everyone back here? Oh, another br break area. Strange. Makes me worry that the next battle is going to be really hard to compensate. So this spot's completely dead. No, there's some mana flowing here. You know a dead you'll know a dead zone when you enter one the first time. You've actually been to one? Back when I was at the academy, we went on a field trip to some ruins. The spot we walked to from a portal was a total dead zone. No mana anywhere. It doesn't sound so bad, but it's like a constant loud silence that you know shouldn't happen. It wears on you. We were going to test the effects of alchemy in that kind of area, but when the others lost it and broke down one of the walls after crafting some exploding potions. Right, I heard about that. Field trips can be dangerous like that, so I'm glad we have so many people with us I can help out. Is that why you're on this trip? Just field trips? Not to, like, help out our buddy here? Honestly, I don't care about the Dark Lord. What? Most of us don't. Our day-to-day -day lives are made no different by her presence. But the fame of defeating her means things like my academy... But the fame of defeating her means things like my academy stand to do better. What? We're all pursuing our dreams in this group, in one way or another. What about you, Dagrun? I have something I want to sur someone I want to surpass, but I do think it's important to fight evil where we can. Goodness, kids like you make me feel better about the future. I wonder when it was I lost that mentality myself. Ma'am? Sorry, got lost in thought for a minute there. Let's head on back. This is enough for today. Okay, how many people... Let's go up to the people near the tree. <clears throat> so yes, you can find some mana-rich areas such as a spot to recover mana quickly. Right, though it can only hold so much and take time to recover. Consider areas of nature like this similar to people, especially when it comes to magic. So it's it's always an area an area that looks like this. You can't feel the flow of mana very well, can you? Oh, not at all. I know how to cast some spells, but that's it. How you made it to the underground program is beyond me. Honestly, you and Francis should switch places. I thought you didn't like him. I don't. Our approaches to magic Fairy are completely oppositional. But he studies and works hard in his shows, and I respect the kid for that. 
I, I'd like to see you do more than just sleep when you should be studying. Oh, great timing. Should we head back? Oh, I totally lost track of time. I'll be testing you on this later, Neil. Yeah, yeah. So you can use the devices to do this. Oh, that's actually useful. You don't need to emphasize the actually so much there. Oh hey, we're learning a couple of magic tricks. Wanna join us? Yeah, she's seen them all before. She's my niece, you know? Really? You and her grandpa do look alike. I'll take that the compliment, but that's not it. I'm married to her Aunt Nausicaa. Oh, I see. Wait. Josephine, your guy's family has, like, no magic lineage at all? Except for your mom, obviously. Even hers comes from her deity. Well, the only person that can actually use magic is Urze, but since she became a vampire. Anyway, we know how it is not to be able to use proper magic, so we'll help you get through this class. Let's head back. Okay, so now we head back and hopefully no boss battle. Hmm. Any other people? Oh, there are a few other sh people left. I still feel like it's kind of useless to use this kind of thing. Sure, it doesn't make direct sense. You get, get that gaining magical power is a good focus. There's only so much time in life, so why focus on anything that's unimportant? But learning to recover mana rapidly this way means you don't have to work on increasing how much you can tolerate. You can just refill and cast continually. Sure, but ley lines dry up after constant use. You and Teach talk about them like they're rivers, but they're like wells. There's only a few good spots in any area for them, and they'll refill slowly. If you expect to use one in an area and it's exhausted, there's a resource you are relying on that's useless. I don't want to rely on this kind of skill. You're actually pretty smart, huh? Oh, now I mean... Josephine, oh, we've been gone too long. Right, let's head back. We've all made it back. We'll see what they learn later, but thank you so much for the help. Seven and eight and a question mark. I don't see the, demon, the Dark Lord's castle yet. Just how many areas are we going through? A beach privateer. Hey, Ark, we were just about to get started. Is Josephine going to train with us? A little bit, at least. She wants to get used to working together with everyone better. Cool, let's start finish stretching and then get to it. Are you training with us, too? No, she's not with our group. I mean, I guess it's hard to keep track of who's traveling with us. Shoot, I only get a subset of the group. You, you're the ones that sunk my ship! Oh, that was your ship? Didn't you fire first? Like that matters now, I'm gonna kill you for this! Ah, oh, that violent aura! Ah! Sis, please stop making this weird. Rafa emerged. You're gonna pay for sinking my ship with your lives! Oh no! I'm guessing if I try to use some kind of cure-all, they would just recast it instantly. Josephine is still here. Arcturus. Problem is... Arg. I need to keep track of everyone's buffs again. Let's see. To buff your accuracy... Tebra Explosive. Superiority, remove random buffs. Okay, that's that works. Okay, good, I have friendship. That means I can buff Arcturus. Okay. 
Okay, now... TJ is not in the party. That's... That's gonna be an issue. I don't, also don't have any means of mana stealing. I can use Corruption Arcturus. Experience. Reduce our MP costs. Sword Fall. The hell is the difference between Sword Fall and... Overhaul. Tim. I really miss Mana Steel. That was a really useful for a situation. Done. Do I have any way to remove debuffs from the whole party? Bravery. What, how will you respond to that? Will they instantly punish me for it? No, some uh, some of them did not get removed. Oh shoot. Arcturus is almost fucking dead. Great. I can't even heal well anymore. Damn, this is a really bad situation. I can't remove debuffs. Everything is just really bad right now. Ah, I lost so much hit points just from trying to fight back. I'm, I'm more than halfway there. I just need to keep going somehow. Arcturus, please do this. Finish him off. Uh.
This is bad. Concentrate. Oh no, Arcturus died! Shit! I'm gonna need to think of a new plan. Good thing I have other types of attacks to deal with here. Deborah, let's see if explosive works on you. Who is my- who could- who is capable of- Do you- uh, Friendship. Okay, need to heal. Bad. Oh, good. Follow up. That helps a little bit. Yes, I won. Ugh. What are you standing around for? Not gonna finish me off? Hmm, what do you think we should do? Don't care, huh? Alright then. Who wants to handle this? And I hate seeing people beg to die. Just drop your weapons and run. You! How dare you! I'll kill her if you want. If you won't. Your call, I guess. Run or die. If you come back, make sure to be stronger, alright? You're already too strong to begin with. We need a whole party for this. Well, that was a good workout. You two okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'll hang back before you three keep flirting. Yeah, let's go. We're not. Alright, number eight. Untrustworthy sword. Is someone in our party going to betray us? So you're sure we need to head this way? Yes, we're going through some ruins here to get to the next area. Right, we've actually been on this island before. I see, she really wasn't kidding about this at all. Forgive my manners, my name is Griselda, and I've been sent by the Dark Lord to defeat you. You're rather d direct, aren't you? What, do you really believe me? Trust is a fickle thing. Sorry, but your numbers are about to mean a lot less. Teamwork reduced to zero? What does that mean? Does that mean I can't use any teamwork abilities? Well, I haven't been re relying on teamwork that much anyways, so... Let's just go with the usual. Arcturus on... Uh, 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 fully buffed. Yeah. Oh wait, the, what the heck? Some of them have status effects to begin with. That's weird. Can I at least use Great Leap? Yes, I can. As long as they fulfill their purpose, I don't care if they lose their teamwork abilities too much. Go with the usual debuffs. And start looking stuff up because I can't remember every single character. Okay, can I stack harsh words on you? Normal attacks? Huh. Didn't really do a whole lot. But, the th but this is something about trust, so maybe we can't trust what we're seeing right now. Uh, so where's T, dear? Wait, Chidi, I'm gonna need to use training buff. Yeah. Whereabouts? Life is pain. Burden. Oh crap, do not target. Please do not target Arcturus, please. It's gonna be bad. Okay, so where's my buffer? 
Ambition. Stoic Fury. Oh, okay, good. You are we, you are properly taking damage from that. Oh no! Do not hit Arcturus with that, please. I don't care about those guys. They're just meat shields so that Arcturus can do his thing. Aha, oh, your attacks barely hurt. As long as I can get that finishing blow without getting the buff, this will be an easy victory. Oh no. Please do not hit Arcturus. Hit anyone except Arcturus, please. The others are just there to support him as he deals massive damage. Cool. I lucked out that time. Oof, your strength isn't just in numbers, huh? I know when I'm beaten. Maybe I'll look for a new employer. Uh, and one last note. A question mark, which implies it's going to be another maze-like map. Like that pyramid, huh? The ruins. Uh, wait, what? See, so these question marks are basically large-scale dungeons that I can't just do a single battle for. Oh, level 6-1, we're in a new level. In that case, I'm saving that for next time. If this is technically a new world. Thanks for watching this Let's Play of I have low stats with my class as leader, so I recruited everyone I know to fight the Demon Lord. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.